Today, I have three different Gorilla Tag fan games that I'm going to be playing for a little bit and then giving an overall score from 1 to 10. And I'm going to be rating these games to see which one's the best. So, without further ado, let's hop into the first game. Alright guys, so the first game that we actually have is a game called Big Scary. Now, Big Scary is probably one of the biggest Gorilla Tag fan games as of today. I've played this game before, as you can tell, I don't know why my hat's yellow now, but whatever, we're just gonna kinda roll with it. Okay, so, Gorilla Tag is, you know, just a regular game where you run around, tag people, it has, a, it has different modes. But, Big Scary is actually a horror game and has absolute. why is my hat red now? Anyways, Big Scary is actually a game... That has nothing to do with getting tagged. It has everything to do with scary monsters and horror everythings. So, let's go check out some of the terrifying levels. And of course I had to record this late at night, because why not? This game has a ridiculous amount of levels. And each level takes about 10 to 15 minutes, maybe even longer depending on your skill level and which level we're talking about. This game has 16 different terrifying levels that hey, take a ridiculous me. amount he of time. So Frankenstein here is going to be my guide because he decided to, you know, volunteer to be my guide through the games. So he's going to be my guide. He's going to show me through all these levels and we're going to try to speed run it too. So, um, yeah, let's go. Okay, just follow me. Okay, I'm just going to follow him. I'm so confused as to why I'm pink right now, but... I know how to get through the first, like... I know how to get through the first couple levels. But I haven't played any of the new levels because they're scurry. Mm-hmm. Gonna climb up here. Help me, please. Where is he? All right, I see him. He's over there. Of course, he's gonna come after me. I press my menu. Let me collect this banana. I pressed my menu button, and that almost certainly spelled death for me. I have no clue where Frankenstein went, but I think he went down here. Alrighty, oh, peeps. Way, we got the wheel. Follow me. Okay, where's the wheel at? So, guys, in this in this uh, level, there's actually three different places the wheel can spawn. It can spawn over here. It can spawn down this hallway, or it can spawn down here. And I am very out of breath already, and this is only, like, what, the fourth level? Yeah. Gotta break his ankles. Oh, dear God. Oh, God, my friend. Come at me, boy. I'm gonna try it, I'm gonna try it, I'm gonna try it. That was a terrible idea. Okay, let's go. Terrible idea. Nope. I thought I had him. Dude, I swear, I feel like my arms are about to fall off. And then you come over here, you open the door with the the wheel, you jump down here, and now we're in the back rooms. We're really not, but this is based off a level from the back rooms. You guys are going to want to go down the yellow slide. Whee! I'll get there eventually. Oh my god, I almost hit my hand on the dresser. Hey, yo, Frankenstein, where you at, bro? Frankenstein? Ain't no way blood just left me like that. Did bro just leave me? My brother. <laughs> bro, he straight ran past like a car. Wee! 
Hey, oh, hold up. How do you see if there was any money on? Okay, so now we have to run down the super dark and long hallway. Then we jump down here, and this is the level I hate the most because it's the vents. And nobody likes Agreed. the vents. I gotta get off. No, my only guide! What Basically, you guys, here? you get the basis of the levels. Basically, it's just a horror game where you have to run around, survive all Subscribe the levels, and yeah. But the overall rating I'm gonna give this game based on quality, experience, and just overall, like... You don't tell me what to do. How, like, just how much I like the game. I'm going to give this game a solid, solid 8.5. Alright, guys, so the next game we have is actually not very well known. It's called Fun Monkey Horror. And, again, it is a horror game. And, holy cow, it's laggy. Not a very good start. Good god, it's lagging. It's lagging so bad right now. Codes. Uh. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just gonna go in here. Skyblock. Level fun. Quiet place. Crawl space. Place. What the heck? In it, but whenever I move, it'll like shake. So I guess on to the next game. I'm gonna give this game like a four. All right, guys. So this game is actually a game that I played before, and it's really good. It's a really good game. You should definitely go check it out. It is called Spaboon, and again, it is a horror game. So yeah. So basically, um, it's a horror game. Basically, it's just the back rooms, but gorilla tag version, kind of, sort of. So, I'm gonna go join a random server. Here, I'm just gonna join code, uh, M-O- Oh, my bad. M-O-N-K- E- Monkey. Let's see if anyone's in this code. Yeah, there's people- Holy cow, it's loud in here. I think I messaged you. But yeah, guys, you can see what I mean by it's incredibly loud and and scary and scary and very scary. Make sure to add that in. So I actually know a really secret. You can actually hide up here in the pipe, so that's a pretty cool secret. But basically, everything that falls out of the map will fall straight back through this pipe and end up in this box. Someone turn off the freaking music. Okay, thank God I finally got that music off. Damn, I did it. Bro, where okay, but basically, there's a bunch of monsters in here, and they just kind of roam around. You have to try to survive and just kind of goof off. I love this game. I've streamed it before, and I will be streaming it again. I'm trying to find, like, a kind of quiet place. I think there's a monkey over here. Monkey! Nope, that's a watermelon. But... Um, yeah, it's a really scary game. You guys should go check it out. It's free on App Lab. Holy cow, you scared me. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna show off some of the cool features. So, first, hey, don't tell me to shut up, kid. So, I'm not going into the elevator. Oh, dear God. Hey, yo, anyone feel like hap- Uh, uh, the 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 bubba the bubba I'm going to the office to get the scanner. Alright guys, we are now in the air ducts. And we have to go through the air ducts. To get to the office. Bruh. Someone already took it to scanner, bruh. Where's my thingy, my jigger? Dude, it's so creepy in the air vents. Brothers! Queso! Brothers! Queso. Oh dear god! I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead.
today's verse is Luke one thirty seven. With God, nothing shall be impossible. The reason this is the quote of the day is because everything that's happened in my life is because God, you know, planned it to happen. He helped me. He helped me build this channel. He helped me get to where I am today. And I owe all of my respect, all of my everything to God.